Hello to you, and we are we are here, and we are doing a thing. I'm doing a thing, and it's a great thing. It's called Bioshock Infinite. It is a an amazing, an amazing game, and we're gonna be doing a let's play in it. And I've played this game once before, and I loved it. And now we're gonna be doing it again, and I'm gonna be doing it again, and you're gonna be watching, hopefully, maybe. I did medium last time. Today we're gonna be doing hard. I almost did 1999 mode, but I just don't know if I'm ready for that kind of challenge yet. I don't know if I'm ready to take on that level of skill quite yet. Okay, alright, here we go. Let's do it. Bioshock Infinite. I really did like this game came out this year. And I'm going to put subtitles on, you guys can read them if you want, but uh, I'm not going to. I'm going to talk over them. So, I mean, that's that's one thing. Uh, man, really fun game. Takes a little bit of a, I don't know, it takes a little bit of time to sort of get going, get started, to where you can have, uh, I mean, it's fun walking around seeing everything, but it, it takes a little bit in order to start, you know, shooting things. <clears throat> and here are two of the best characters in the game right here, the row people, they're great, I love them, I love these row people. Booker DeWitt, that's your character, that's who you are. I like this game. It's fun. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> Essentially, what's going on in this game, um, you'll see, I guess. Doesn't matter. Anyway, this is my first series Let's Play, I guess, with like a story. I'm going to be doing these, going to be releasing these from time to time. Uh, and it's going to be super fun. I like that. All right, so that's Elizabeth bring her back to New York unharmed. That's my mission. He doesn't row. No, he sees. She sees. She sees what it means. Okay. Oh, I'm looking around. Here I am. The sensitivity is way up. I don't know if I like that. We'll see. Okay. Here we are. There's a ladder. Okay, this is uh, the control scheme for this game. It's different than other PC games. And I recently just played a couple of first person shooters on the PC. So I need to readjust myself to this this control scheme. Usually to interact with objects it's it's E. But this this control scheme is F to interact with things. And I have the feeling that exploration will be rewarded in this game. And by, I have a feeling, it means I've already played this game, so I know. Um, there's currency in this game called Silver Eagles. Whoa! Bring us the girl and wipe away the dead. This is your last chance. I guess you're expecting me? Of thy sins shall I wash thee. Oh. Ah, oh, look at my face. Looking good. Okay. I've turned subtitles on. I've turned uh, so if I if I look at something and I read it, I guess. See, it shows up on the side. Okay. All right. I promise I won't spend twenty years exploring, doing everything. Maybe, maybe twenty years, maybe eighteen though. Okay. We're in a lighthouse, very pretty lighthouse, very reminiscent of another Bioshock game. And I've actually never finished the original Bioshock because just I, I played it after this one. It was tough. The actually, let me get that out of the way real quick. Uh, the original Bioshock and the sequel, the follow-up to Bioshock, Bioshock Two, have nothing to do with this game, other than the fact like there's vigors or you whoa or like the fact that it's a first person shooter and you can like shoot electricity out of your hands other than that is there's no correlation between the story necessarily um there is a little bit of it i don't know there's there's some there's some things that are similar and they kind of do like little shout outs to the other games but it's you don't you don't need to know the story of the other games in order to play cuz i certainly didn't
I tried to play Bioshock the original after this one, and it just wasn't uh, wasn't quite the same. Maybe I'll finish it someday. But this game was top notch. This game is very reminiscent of Half Life Two, in my opinion. Just another great game. All right, we're supposed to go in there, but there's something over here. Okay. All right, we are rich so far. 16 silver eagles. You kidding me? Use the bells. Okay. One, two, 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 two. That was a tough puzzle. Whoa. One thing I love about this game is just the, the design. Everything is so pretty. Can't jump over. I'm trying. Mm, got a little bit of a dance remix here. Whoa, the stairs disappeared. Can't get back down. What is that in the distance? You see that? You see that in the distance? What is that light over there? Is that a city? Oh, there's some over there too. Whoa. Brought up a little barber chair here. Alright. Here we go. We're plunging. I'm a pilgrim. I met the Native Americans at Plymouth Rock in 1618. I don't know when that video was. When was Plymouth Rock? I don't know. My gun is gone. This would be terrifying. I'm in a rocket ship. They did not invent these. In 1912, if I'm not mistaken. This game is based on a true story, I think. Pretty sure it is. Yeah, I'm almost positive it is now I think about it. Oh, what? Hallelujah. Are we in heaven? See, like this right here is kind of like a shout out to the original Bioshock, where you go underwater and you're first viewing the city. Very reminiscent, very similar. But let's just enjoy this for a moment. And just how pretty this game is. And just how how gorgeous they make everything look. And how nice they make America look. Because America's not this nice. Father Comstock, our prophet. Is he like the prime minister? Alright. That was nice. Why would he send his savior unto us if we will not raise a finger for our own salvation? And though we deserve not his mercy, he has led us to this new Eden. A last chance for redemption. What? What did that eat? What? There's some pretty music in the distance. I don't know if you guys can hear it. And the prophet shall lead the people to the new Eden. So this prophet, he's like God, I guess. Release me. Oh, here we go. Release, release. Okay. So this is just, look at the water. Look at how pretty everything is. I was ju I just came out of this chair. I'm gonna turn the brightness up next part. Oh, I can do that right now maybe. Whoa, that is super bright. I'm gonna turn that back down just a little bit. That's good.
Ho hopefully you guys can read. Oh, so pretty. And in my womb shall grow the seed of the prophet. People just, apparently, if you go to a church or something, people just lay money around. Oh, these are awesome. Love the prophet because he loves the sinner. Love the sinner because he is you. Without the sinner, what need is there for a redeemer? Without sin, what grace has forgiveness? I will be playing every single one of these I come across because those are just awesome little tidbits of information. They usually those in games are kind of boring, but in games like this and in games like Dead Space, they do a great job of really bringing the world to life. So I'm going to be playing those whenever I get the chance, whenever I find them. And I came pretty close to finding all of them uh, in my in my first playthrough. I came really close actually. I don't I don't remember how many there were, but I was maybe like 6 or 7 short. I think they're like close to 80. I don't know for sure though. This could be my bad. Whoa. Yeah, so the money shines. That's how you know that's money. Oh, I forgot I can run. Sorry about that. Excuse me. Where am I? Heaven. Or as close as we'll see till judgment day. Whoa. Ask you such questions to myself. That guy sounded oddly African American. Okay. Look at this water. Look at these graphics. Wow, that's some pretty water. And the reflection. Top notch. And every year on this day of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Cosmo. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks and by submerging ourselves. The path of forgiveness is the only way to the city. Is, it someone is that true? Do I have to go there? Oh, that guy just told me. That guy just... That guy with his African-American voice. How do you guys all look similar? That's not true. You can go through the Gulf of Mexico. gonna drown me I don't, know, brothers and sisters. I don't think that's how you do a baptism if I'm not mistaken whoa what's going on I was just in water now there's a door someone's banging on that door bring us the girl wipe away the dead open that door Whoa! This is not. Whoa! This is that's a structurally that's a poor front door. No one puts it on the side of a building like that. Is that? Whoa! Looks like they're holding shotguns at me. Is that? That's Benjamin Franklin. Ah! It didn't. It didn't let me show off my skills. I knew that was Thomas Jefferson. I knew it. That is a shotgun. Why did I think that? Why did I think otherwise? Okay. To Father Franklin, key of gold, so that Eden might have the mystery that set her above all other nations. That is not a shotgun. That is a scroll, apparently. And so each year we recommit ourselves. Okay. All right. Our prophet fills our lungs with water, so they may better love the air. Hey, that oddly didn't make any sense at all. Do you even... Wow. Who taught your anatomy class? Okay. Um... Okay, same thing. I just want to explore. I want to love this game. Is 
I want to love everything about this game. There is too much money lying around to just throw into wells. Okay, so that's a big thing right there. It just showed me salt. Um, salt is how I get my power, and I'll get my power a little bit later in the game. But there's health, and then there's salt. You you need health in order to, you know, live, be alive. And you need salt in order to do like crazy, awesome powers that you can shout, like shoot people with electricity and stuff. Man, this game is nice. Mmm, that was, that was oysters or aphrodisiacs, if you didn't know that. If you don't know what an aphrodisiac is, read a book. Okay. I like hot dog. I'll take that hot dog for you. Two dollars for a hot dog? Once you realize we're in 1912, that's freaking ridiculous. I could buy a, I can buy a month's worth of rent for 20 bucks. I don't know. How much, um, what is the equivalent to $2 in 1912? Ooh, that's... See, you can, you can repair fine custom work, a specialty, for $1. And you're, you expect me to pay double that for a hot dog? Don't be ridiculous. Oh, boxophone. Beautiful. Beautiful. So that's the... You fall off the edge, that's what happens. Apparently I can't even jump to that right there. Yeah, nope, I can't jump anywhere. Oh, okay. I will be taking my sweet time, I hope you don't mind. I am... I'm not gonna giddy up anywhere in this game, because it is just far too nice to, to not, you know, do that. Nice little horse there. A vision of a great city. The prophet Comstock leads his people out of the Sodom below. Haha, <laughs> Sodom. A miracle child is born. The future of the city is secured. Okay, all right. Please wait. By order of the Columbia Police Academy. Did I say department or academy? I don't know. I should have read more. I'm pretty sure the Columbia Police are pretty. Uh, they're they're pretty corrupt down there. And by down there, I mean in the Columbia, the country. You know. South America. It's a place. Read a book. I'll be taking that. You are on your honor. Huh. Cake. Delicious. My health is full. Will not let me do anything. I can still eat stuff, though. Just because your health is full doesn't mean your tummy is. That's a lesson you need to learn right now. And these are dumb. I'm never going to look at those. They suck. 
Actually, I'm going to. I'm going to look at this particular one, and then you can see how dumb they are, and then you can realize why I'm never, ever going to look at one again, ever again. <sighs> Dumb. That was, oh, what is that? Shut up. Get out. I'm done with that. So that's why we will never look at the kin kinetoscope. <gasps> My favorite part of the game right over there. Would you care for a boutonniere? We're raising money for the girls' patriotic league. Yeah, I would love Maybe one. Time. Maybe next time, though. Boxophone. One man goes into the waters of baptism. A different man comes out, born again. But who is that man who lies submerged? Perhaps that swimmer is both sinner and saint until he is revealed onto the eyes of man. Check out this barbershop quartet. Singing some good old Beach Boys. Oh man. I'm just gonna, just gonna sit here and let you guys enjoy. Just beautiful. All right, let's continue on. How many viewers are left? I appreciate all two of you. Okay. All right, let's do it. What's up, kids? All right, let's go. There she is. There she blows. They said I'd find her. Telegram, Mr. Dewitt. Telegram for you, sir. For me? No one even knows I'm here. Do not alert Comstock to your presence. Stop. Whatever you do, do not take number 77. Stop. No text. Hmm? I'm using the telescope. Whoa! People are juggling down there. They were just there. I swear they were just there. Did you see them? They're gone. That was crazy. Man. It's like this is a video game or something. It's like they can just change graphical things. My good day to you, sir. Hello. They were just right there. I gotta take this trash can. I've eaten so much, I'm gonna be full for days. Look, I started out with five in my bank, and now I have 70. I'm rich. Okay. Um, anyway, this is, these are really cool little, like, mini games that kind of teach you how to play the game, but since I already know how to play the game, I'm not going to waste time on them, even though you get, like, prizes and stuff or whatever. I'm not going to do that, because it's going to take, you know, it's going to take quite a while to, to do all of them. So I'm just going to go ahead and get to the point where I start actually getting vigor. Have you ever lost a penny to a vending machine? 
appreciate it. Okay. This is cool. I really like this vigor. I like all the vigors. The vigors are awesome. She is very weird looking. Her eyes are odd. Mm, boom! Skip it. I'll tell you what it means. Possession. Uh, enter. Yeah, there we go. Essentially, what this is, is uh, whatever I say is my friend, like whatever I point at. There you are. There we go. Anyway, what I was saying was, uh, I have this vigor. A vigor is a thing that's a super power, kind of. It will let you do some crazy awesome things. So there's like a fireball vigor, there's a lightning Sorry, vigor. <laughs> yeah, anyway, it'll, this particular vigor will make things your friend. Like I just made that robot right there my friend, he let me through. Okay, let's do it. Let's go through. Oh, it's these guys. Whoa, he's got a lot of heads. What does that even mean? What's going on? Okay, let's do it. You mind letting me walk? Oh, I was able to walk the whole time. I was pressing the wrong button. Man, I'm smart. Okay, this is the dollar bill machine. Oddly enough, things a lot more expensive than a dollar bill. Okay. I mean, have you seen my face? Whoa. Sing praise to the songbird, for he is the protector of the lamb. Wow, that was weird. What the hell? R. Latus gave Columbia her wings. Let's listen. Madam Lutess. Lutess. All your books on the sciences. Mama says it's not a fit occupation for a lady. But I think she's jealous of our cleverness. Is it true that only you are allowed to visit the girl in the tower? If the lamb is lonely too, I should like to meet her, as we would have much in common. Warmest regards, Constance. The lamb in the tower. You shall know the false prophet by his mark. What? I have that mark. How'd they know I was coming? You f Ooh, do you use Google? Okay. Let's do this thing. Oh man, I'm I'm excited. The 1912 raffle has officially begun. Mister, Mister. Sorry, go we'll sail. <laughs> Silly, there's never a charge for the raffle. You've been sleeping under a rock. Maybe. Oh no. Seven. That's a lucky number. I'll be rooting for you. Bring me. Didn't that thing say not to choose 77? Not the prettiest young white girl in all of Columbia? So there are prettier black girls, is what you're saying? The winner is number 77. What do you know? Yep, yep. I'm going to claim it. First, what? Oh no. Please, what are you doing? Come on, 
Oh my goodness. It said groom. They're they're married. Oh, okay. All right. No! I didn't get to throw it. Don't you know that makes you the backstabbing snake in the grass, false shepherd? Does it? And we ain't letting no false shepherd into our flock. <laughs> Show them what we got planned, boys. Whoa. Whoa. We got some craziness going on already. Come on now. Fight. Fight me. I will kill you. Alright. You wanna fight? You wanna fight? I'll fight you. I'll melee you to death. Let me get some stuff from you guys. What, what do you got? What do you got? Finally, we get to kill somebody. Alright. Now the game starts to heat up. I am just... I'm running and... Meleeing and ooh, right hook, left hook, left hook. I will destroy you. Sorry if you can't really see us all that well. I'm going pretty crazy here. Ah, that's. Uh, oh goodness! I have a gun. I have a gun. And I have possession. The game is heated up. The game is heated up. Here we go. Oh, box phone. Listen to it while I'm in combat. I told you, Comstock. You saw a paradise in the Oh, hold on. Um. Mm, why not? Yeah, I'll get that. Okay, so basically. Ah, whenever I'm done with them, whenever I like take possession over someone, now they'll just kill themselves whenever I'm done with them. Go kill some people for me. I have a man in Georgia who leases as many Negro convicts as you can board. Why, you can say they're simple souls in penance for rising above their station. Oh, okay. Whatever eases your conscience, I suppose. That's a turret. That turret will take out everything for me. I don't... I don't trust them. They tried to kill me. Okay. Still getting used to the... Uh Oh. Still getting used to the uh, picking everything up. Because I just, I forgot how to do everything. Okay. I don't like any of you guys. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, whoa, oh, whoa, gonna die. I'm out of Vox. Ah! The first casualty. Man, that sucks. What just happened? I'm not good at this game, okay? That was the last guy, too. I could have totally gotten health from these guys. I don't know why I didn't. I'm sure. I'm sure everyone's disappointed in me. The first enemies of the game, the first firefight of the game, and I'm dead. That's a, that's a good sign, right? It's a good sign that I should be playing on hard mode.
Yeah. Yeah. Get him. This game is fun, though. I'm already having fun. Sorry it took so long for this part to get started. Alright. What's going on? It's getting hot. What's going on? What is going on? <sighs> well, that's terrifying. Well, that is absolutely terrifying. Can't escape. Can't go anywhere. The only saving grace is that I can shoot fast. Oh God! Run, run, run! That's provision. That's some health. Bring him out to the open. No, he got me. I'm already getting my ass beat in. I'm gonna be poor by the end of this. He's terrifying. I can't beat him. Am I supposed to melee him? It's exploding. He's throwing grenades at me. They didn't have grenades in 1912. He's about to explode. He's about to explode. In my face. A vigor. Thank goodness. Oh my gosh. I'm terrible at this game. I'm going to die in five seconds every single time I play. I am dead. I'm dead. That was terrifying. Alright, I get it. This one throws fireballs. We get it. That wasn't no sample. That wasn't no sample? Nice English. Okay. I've wasted so much ammo already. Is there any ammo over here? Nope, took it. I didn't expect that guy to be that hard to beat. thing I did a thing and I blew him up I'm gonna have to start meleeing people did I get some ammo did I get some oh what up how's it feel to be dead probably not great okay Oh, got some salt. Nice. Alright, 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 alright. We're doing fine. I've only died like three times. Twice. Only died twice. Only died twice, like the first chapter. Okay, guys. Well, that is, um. That's gonna do it for today. First part of what's hopefully a very exciting Let's Play for everyone. Ha <laughs> Not really. Okay. And, uh, I will see you guys later. Uh, bye.